the going theme is, whether it's social media, just in life in general, like if you do good things, impactful things, you don't get noticed. That's why everybody is out there just trying to do the most outlandish things to, to get clicks. When I'm able to do this, <laughs> I promise you, this is going to inspire so many young black kids. What's going on guys? It is Sunday, July 28th, 7.44 in the morning. Um, get ready to upload for YouTube today. And um, see what the rest of the day has in store. Definitely a beach day. Weather is back sun out, I can feel the heat, and um, definitely going to swim today. <laughs> it's always it's such a luxury to have the beach just right there, you know. So yeah, I'm gonna do that, do some relaxing. Man, once you start putting your systems in place, things just become easier and easier and easier yes to get to where you want to go is hard work and everything and dedication but it's also it's also about working smart so um that's what i'm gonna do right now is work smart my system is already in place so all i gotta do is upload sunday man God's day. I've never heard of this term until last Monday. It's called Tam, Sam, and Sam. Tam, T-A-M, Sam, S-A-M, and Sam. S-O-M. And um, if you've been watching my videos, you understand that and you know that uh, I've been an entrepreneur for 18 years, over 18 years. And in the meeting with my startup coach, he introduced me to Tam, Sam, and Sam. And um, I'm, gonna st I'm studying it. And man, this is like, really, really high level stuff. And I wanna share with you guys because these are, these are things that as a novelist or a beginner in business, you will not really have access to because people aren't going to share something like this with you. This is a little bit more high level. Uh, business startup things, you know, uh, knowledge per se. Um, and from what I've gained is that everyone should be addressing and doing Tam Sam song for their business, okay? And calculating this format for their business. Um, so yeah. Let's just, I want to go over the definitions of Sam's song. Sam, <laughs> Sam, Tam Sam song. <laughs> okay, so Tam, T-A-M, is your total market for your product. Okay, the total market. So, I, so with, with this formula, you're actually going to break down who your target customers are, is and how much market share you can gain, okay? So TAM, total market for your product. SAM, percentage of SAM you can realistically capture. So 
you have a total market for your product. So let's just say, let's, uh, because I, I'm the founder of All Dreams, we'll use All Dreams, okay? It's 450 million athletes worldwide, okay? 450 million athletes, that's worldwide. That's the total market for the All Dreams platform, okay? Now, Sam, what percentage can All Dreams realistically capture of that 450 million of worldwide athletes, okay? So I have to break that down from total addressable market to what I can realistically um, capture, okay? So the portion of the market you can acquire based on your business model and your target, okay? So some is the portion of the market that we can actually acquire based on our business model and our, our target market, basically, okay? Um, some is like, how much can we, can we dominate? Okay, so you have the total, then you have the realistic, and then you have how much can we dominate? Can we dominate our market to get 10 million users and just and dominate that or dominate one, you know, 1 million users, right? Um, and so that breaks, that breaks down uh, Tam Samsung, sorry, because it's, it's a, it's, it's really a, it's, it's a, it's a tongue twister to be honest with you, but that's what Tam Samsung is, right? So I just wanted, I wanted to share that because the, this is, like I said, this is, I've been in business for such a long time and I've never until last Monday even heard of Tam Samsung. So always be willing to learn more you cannot never think that you know it all because there's so much to learn at every single point in your life right like i'm such a willing learner like please teach me teach me teach me teach me things that you know that can um stimulate my mind and also that I can use, utilize in my business, I can utilize in life. Uh, so you always have to be willing to, to learn things, you know? Um, that's it, you know, that's a humility thing as well, you know? Um, not thinking, you know, I know it all, okay? Because I don't, I don't think that, right, at all, at all. I, I'm a willing learner, but Man, this is this is powerful, powerful stuff or whatever, you know. Um, and it goes deeper into you know into it. But as I'm you know going out to talk to investors, these are things that I need to know, like the back of my hand, secondhand nature. Okay. Um, so yeah, I, I wanted to share that with you guys. Um, seriously, look it up, look it up, Tam Samsung, um, it's, it's powerful, it's powerful stuff, you know, total market, then, you know, then you, you know, you break it down, you have this huge, huge market, you know what I mean, and then realistically, I can get this market, and then what market can I dominate, okay, and if you think of, I mean, if you break that down into any business, I mean, Look, just like, let's just break it down real fast for, let's just say a restaurant in the city, okay? You have a restaurant in the city. You have, your total addressable market in that city would be everyone in the city and surrounding areas in that city, okay? Then you kind of break it down to realistically. So maybe you break it down just into the, the greater area of that city, okay? That's realistically who you can market to, not the entire surrounding areas. Then you break it down to what you can dominate, which may be 
a great business to dominate just in your area of your, your neighborhood. And that could be viable for that business. So I felt it beneficial to show you guys what goes into when you are starting to work with your development team for your application. Um, these are the things that you are going to need, okay? And you could need different things like in this aspect, you might, you know, you might need a different account for or a different type of software for Firebase, but this is what we're using. So for your front end development, you're gonna need the, of course, the, the Apple development account. Uh, so you'll be listening to the, to the App Store, the Google Play account. And then um, we're using Firebase and uh, GitLab. So this is all the front end. And then the back end, um, we're using uh, AWS as Amazon Web Services. And then for us, we have, uh, our payments are going through Stripe. So we have we have that. Um, but this is like just the, the information that I want to share. Again, it's still Sunday, July 28th. At this point now, it's 9.30 a.m. So been in here working. But um, so I had to get all of these things to my developers so they can start uh, their job in uh, building out the All Dreams application uh, once again, because you know we had got the milestone one and that went to fire. So yeah, just wanted to share this information. Like um, again, like what I what I'm doing is like building in public so so what i'm doing is i'm i'm building in public and i'm showing everything that i'm actually doing so at some point someone will do want to do the same thing in a similar situation build something i'm showing exactly what i'm doing as i'm doing it Okay, even to the point, look, this is a YouTube video that's uploading right now or trying to upload, but I don't know what's going on with this thing. This is supposed to be my daily, but seems like it's something going on with these uploads today. I don't know. What? <clears throat> Listen. When I'm able to do this, <laughs> for real, when I'm able to do this, I promise you, this is going to inspire so many young black kids. Like with my past and my journey, it's going to inspire so many young people and older people like I'm like really can't put it in words of like I like really feel like a like a, a vessel just being used and I don't, I don't talk too much about spirituality but I'm very very spiritual um, but this, what, what I'm doing right now, um, the person that I'm becoming is just a vessel to inspire people maybe with the same background, but then also support 
athletes. Like this is going to, <clears throat> like, I, like this is going to be, out. You know, like legendary, legendary shit. Because what they say is, yo, if you, this is this is what the going, the going theme, is, whether it's social media, just in life in general. Like if you do good things, impactful things, you don't get noticed. That's why everybody is out there just trying to do the most outlandish the most outlandish things to to get clicks clickbaity shit you know I'll say this so people can click on it I'll do this cause a controversy so people will watch like I'm going to change that complete narrative like a real ass dude People gonna be starting to tune in like, yo, I'm rocking with this. This is the counter, the, the antithesis, I think it is, of this. Clickbaity, controversy, no purpose, no impact, no journey. Don't care about people, only care about themselves. The flip side is what we doing over here. We're gonna create an army of people that's gonna make impact in the world. That's gonna make money, help people at the same time, inspire people. Like, that's. That's mission possible. That's mission possible. And still stay the same, like, the same person. When I say the same person, I mean like the same values. You know, I believe you had to become a different person than you were, but Maintaining those same values, like, that's what's most important to me. Never selling out. If that makes any sense. Because, yeah, like, in all honesty, I did, like, literally, I killed the old me. It's just not there. It's over. It's dead. It's a brand new me walking into this new, this new path, leaving all that shit behind, leaving all that other shit behind. You know, the anger, the, the entitlement, the victimhood. To hurt and just forgive and lead with love. All that other stuff, I, I left it in my. I left. I, I left it in a dead person. Now I, I, every single day, I, I just leave with. I just leave with love. I'm not perfect, but that's what I'm leading with. Any anything, anybody. I forgive. Not to say I won't say nothing about it, but I forgive. I'm leading with love now. And that's why that one video, like like 9,000 some odd days of healing, like that's what that was about. That shit was about airing everything out. Airing that shit out. Boom, dead. Nepotism video, airing that shit out. This yo, this is what happened to me. Boom, buried. Let's move forward. Do some of these things still affect me? Of course. 
But at the end of the day, the new me still leading with love. I forgive, I forgive everything. Don't forget, but I forgive everything. Not taking any of that with me moving forward. I'm the lion, scars all over my face, nose twisted from being punched. However many times, scars under my eye, I'm bruised up, been in wars. We're still here, still learning, still fighting, still ferocious, you know? The example of this is something that you can do too. The inspiration, when they all said, they all said you wasn't gonna be nothing. They all said, yo, you'll be dead by 21. They all said, you'll go to jail again. When you lost it all, they all said he's finished now. And still you arose. Because you never quit. That's what inspiration that I'm trying to show in real time. What's going on guys? It is around 4.45 p.m. Sunday. Did not make it to the beach today. Finna head to the basketball court, shoot some hoops a little bit and then um, go get dinner, call it a night, edit this video, get ready for Monday. Got a big week this week, as, as in every week is a big week. So um, yeah, that's what's going on right now. So I'm just headed to the court. Shoot a little bit of hoops. Fitness man, you know, trying to stay active. Uh, 44, man, gotta keep my health up. So, so definitely, I can't do any of this stuff without being healthy. So, number one priority is to stay healthy. And um, keep my mind healthy as well. So, yeah. There you go, capture this fool right here. Look, he don't even see me. I don't know if he see me, but. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? I'm chilling, bro. Guess we're going to be halfway in the street. What's going on? Chilling, chilling. Big bro Haas in the building. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> working, I'm working. Hey, I'm Oh. Hey, 
Boy, 13 years old. Out here giving them the grown man business. Yes, sir. I got it. 